So everybody, good evening. I wanted to do a quick review of this. This is the SMSL SU-1 DAC. Budget piece. You can get them on Amazon for about 70 bucks is what they run. Um, pretty simple DAC. You've got your outputs, three inputs. Now, if you're using the optical or the coax, uh, it has to be powered by a wall wart, which is fine. Basically, a standard USB power brick, kind of like what would come with a cell phone, or used to come with a cell phone anyway. Um, around the front, we've got our uh, indicators, input indicators. It also has an MQA light as well when you're streaming MQA to it. I've never been much of an MQA fanatic, but it's there. It works. Um, you got input selector, as well as if you press and hold it, it's kind of your off button, on and off. Uh, yeah, pretty simple, pretty diminutive. It's about four inches by about three inches uh, by roughly an inch thick, including the little feet. But yeah, simple, works great. I picked this up mostly because it's cheap, number one, and also the reviews on this thing is ecstatic. Everybody is like flying off the belt by this thing, and I was surprised by it too. My experience with budget DAX, particularly from the Chi-Fi companies, no offense to anybody, but from Topping or SMS, S, SMSL, is that they kind of, they can sound good and detailed, and you maybe get good separation of instruments and kind of the strands of music, but they kind of come across as sounding thin, like mass in mass. Like uh, John Darko does a great analogy with that. He talks about it as milk, um, you know, a lot of the chi Chinese DACs tend to come across as sounding like skim milk. Whereas, um, conversely, versus like, you know, whole milk or full fat milk. Uh, this kind of bucks the trend. It's very kind of rich and thick in the mid-range. Very kind of warm sounding if we want to be sort of technical about it. Um, the mid-range is where it really excels. It's just fantastic across the mid-range. It's actually one of the best DACs I've heard in that respect, despite its price. I mean, I'm serious. It's just a fantastic piece. It really, truly is excellent. Uh, I am going to return it to Amazon just because this was kind of an experiment and sort of mostly just, just do it for the review. But yeah, uh, it's one of my favorite DACs I've heard, and it's just fantastic. So if you're in the market for a DAC, pick this up. You can't beat the price. I mean, you can't beat the price. I actually like this better than the Modi. I know people are going to come at me with that. Oh, the Modi's better. And the Modi does great things, but I like the sound signature of this better. It's more organic sounding. It's more kind of natural sounding uh, than the Modi. But yeah, that's it. Stay tuned. We got more.